Przemek Karnowski tied a career high with 22 points. And number nine, Gonzaga beat Washington State 81-66 last night. The seven-footer dominated the Cougars inside the paint, making 10 of 12 shots, including a flurry of left-handed hooks. Kyle Whittager added 21 points, and Bar Brian Wesley added 20 for the Zags, who were coming off an overtime loss at Arizona. Gonzaga star guard Kevin Pangos hit the floor hard on a layup in the opening minutes and was held scoreless for the first time in his career. Josh Hawkinson had 18 points and 11 rebounds for Washington State, which has lost four straight to Gonzaga. Devontae Lacey and Ike Arebu scored 14 apiece. The Zags have won 31 straight home games. It's the second longest streak in the nation. Oregon quarterback Marcus Mariota and Alabama wide receiver Amari Cooper are up for awards tonight at the College Football Award Show. Mariota is a finalist for both the Davey O'Brien National Quarterback Award and the Maxwell Award as the nation's outstanding collegiate player. He's also the front runner to win the Heisman Trophy on Saturday. The O'Brien Award has been a Heisman predictor recently with the previous four recipients going on to win the Heisman. Cooper, one of three Heisman finalists, is trying to become the first Alabama player to win the Bolitnikoff Award. The honor recognizes the nation's top receiver. The winter meetings are concluding in San Diego while the Mariner rumors continue to swirl. After adding Nelson Cruz, the Mariners aren't shy about wanting to add another bat. According to Jim Bowden of ESPN, the M's are in talks with the Nationals for shortstop Ian Desmond. What the M's would have to give up is unclear, but Desmond is a proven hitter in the league with 24 homers last season. The M's also have rumored interest in White Sox outfielder Dion Viciato. He seems like a stay away for the M's as Viciato's numbers aren't very impressive. He's also known to be a hothead in the clubhouse. Free agent Melky Cabrera is still on the market if Mariner front office still has money to spend. Cabrera hit 301 with 16 home runs last season with Toronto. There is plenty of high school sporting events going on in the basin this weekend. Quincy Wrestling is hosting Warden Friday. The Afraid, Wrest the Afraid of Wrestling invite takes place Saturday morning. Moses Lake opens Big Nine League basketball play at home Saturday evening against Wenatchee. Warden hosts Lake Roosevelt and Quincy hosts Othello on Saturday as well. If you have the opportunity to get out and support your favorite team, players and coaches will appreciate your support. We'll be right back after this. <laughs> 